The European Spallation Source, also known as ESS, is a multidisciplinary research facility in Lund, Sweden. The Active Cells facility is a fully remotely operated radioactive waste processing facility. RACE is the UK AEA Centre for Remote Applications in Challenging Environments. It is the systems integrator for the Active Cells and it has managed the project from the very start. Within the process cell, we accept waste and then we will cut it into smaller pieces, which we call size reduction, and then package it up so it can be transported away. The high radioactivity of the waste means that so we have to do all the work with robots and remote handling. Within the process cell, we have two wire saws. One of these wire saws has already been installed and tested within the cell in Sweden. The other one is currently in the race work hall over here in Cullum. The manipulators installed on the test stand has enabled us to do a significant amount of testing at site, which includes junction box replacement, replacement of the wire and pulley for the wire saw, and replacement of pneumatic panel, and handling of lifting equipment and some of the commercially off-the-shelf equipments remotely. To enter the maintenance cell, the waste is carried through the interlaid doors. These are a pair of huge radiation shielding doors that separate the two cells. The facility houses a fully remotely operated grapple crane which allows for the opening of the storage pits which sit beneath the maintenance cell floor and the safe storage of the waste underneath. When an outward road transport is ready, the waste will exit the cell through the waste transfer area. The waste is lowered into a shielded container and then the waste transfer system transports the waste out of the active cells and into the transportation hall. All remote handling operations are managed within the control room. Using the custom-built control system, operators have access and control of all of the equipment within inside the active cells facility. Much of this is hosted in the technical galleries, some of which are, are rack rooms containing electrical equipment. There's hundreds of kilometres of cable and, and many boxes and penetrations for getting cabling into the cell. So the technical galleries also include the component transfer hatch. The component transfer hatch is a bespoke system for transferring hazardous items from the process cell safely into a glove box on the cold side. A key goal of the project is to work in partnership with industrial partners. In particular, we're keen to help support UK industry and to build the fusion supply chain in the future. But we also work with suppliers across Europe and beyond. RACE are the systems integrator for the active cells. They have brought a unique expertise that was essential for this project, and that is knowledge on how to do maintenance in a highly hazardous environment, which is our working environment. The active cells is a perfect case study for the type of facility that Fusion will need. In the delivery of the active cells, um, UKA has not only had an opportunity to collaborate with the world leading science community on a really complex world leading project, but also uh, it's developing the technology and systems that will be really needed for fusion in the future.